Hello everyone, welcome to Drew Tutorial. I'm Andrew and in this video I'm going to show you two easy ways how you can disable Windows Defender. Now if you don't know what is Windows Defender, Windows Defender is Microsoft default security application and by right this should always be on. And there are times we might need to disable this tool and a good example is when we're installing third-party applications. Now let's jump into the first way. Now what you want to do is right click on the Windows icon on the taskbar and go to settings, then privacy and security. Then here you will see Microsoft security, you want to click that. Then virus and threats protection. And here on the virus and threat protection settings, you want to click manage settings and you want to turn off these so real-time protection, you'll trigger you, go ahead and choose yes. You want to turn off cloud delivery protection and as well, you can turn off the automatic sample submission. And once you do this, you will disable the Microsoft Defender. Now, if you want to turn it on, all you have to do is go back to the same steps and turn them on. You might need to restart your computer as well to have this effectively working properly. Now, let me go ahead and show you the second way how you can go ahead and disable this. So again, right click on the Windows icon in the taskbar. This time you want to hit run. And here you want to type regedit. Go ahead and press OK. This trigger prompt, go ahead and choose yes. And here on the H key local machine, you want to click that. Then go ahead and choose software. And you want to look for policies. So here are the policies, you want to expand that. Microsoft and here if you just drag this across you will see Microsoft Defender what you want to do is just right click on this go ahead and choose new and do a D word value so go ahead and select that and here you you want to change this to disable anti-spyware you want to write it just like this without any space then once you're done go ahead and double click on this and change this value from a zero to a one and this is basically the second way how you can disable the windows defender now if at any point in time you want to enable it again all you have to do is just follow the steps come here and delete this go ahead choose yes and then go ahead and restart your computer and that's all there is to it so guys if you found some value within this tutorial go ahead and give this video a like if you've not yet subscribed, feel free to subscribe to the channel to see much more videos coming out every week like this one. See you next time.